Let me ask you one last question in this regard. I, clearly, there were irregularities in the last election. There are irregularities in all elections. But I, I want to ask you a specific question. Do you think the 2020 election was stolen from Donald Trump? And, and in continue, continuing to make that charge, not uh, having states do election reforms, but specifically making this charge that the election was stolen, do you think that that hurts, undermines American democracy? Well, Chris, I've been very clear from the beginning. If you look at a number of states, they didn't follow their state passed laws that govern the election for president. That is what the United States Constitution says. They don't say that the states determine what the rules are. They say the state legislatures determine the, but the rules. But the states all certified. States, they didn't the, follow those state legislative rules. The, the states but they all didn't certified. They did follow those legislative rules. Right. But at the end of the day, are we going to follow what the Constitution says or not? I hope we get back to what the Constitution says. But clearly, in a number of states, they didn't follow those legislatively. So set you rules. think the election was so stolen? I, I, stolen? What I said is there are states that didn't follow their legislatively set rules. That's what the United States Constitution says. And I think there are a lot of people that want us to get back to what the Constitution says we should be doing, not just with elections, with a lot of other things, too. And then there are some people that want to just ignore what the Constitution says and do their own thing. You know, that's been a debate that's been going on in this country for a long time. But do you, uh, why do don't you, we just do, get back to the Constitution? I, I, we don't I, have that problem. I, and, and there certainly can happen. But there are people out there. There was a rally for President Trump yesterday, and a number of people said, Joe Biden's not my president. Uh, Donald Trump is my president. I guess the question is, do you think the election, uh, last time, I promise, do you think the election was stolen or not? I understand you think there were irregularities and things that need to be fixed. Do you think the election was stolen? Yeah. And it's not just irregular. It's states that did not follow the laws set, which the Constitution says they're supposed to follow. When you see states like Georgia cleaning up some of the mess and people calling that Jim Crow law, that's a flat-out lie. Uh, I think well, most that's people the, need that's to stand the new up law, against but, that and, sort of thing. All right.